Hello, you're welcome. As you saw this nice exponential equation, solution from here. From here, we take 5 raised to the power 6 to the left hand side, and what we have becomes x minus 1, 4 raised to the power 6, minus 5 raised to the power 6, then equals to 0 here. That is, here we can write this as x minus 1, 4 raised to the power 3, then 4 raised to the power 2. Minus also 5 raised to power 3 or raised to power 2, then equals to 0 here. And this follows when we have a square minus b square, which is the same thing as a plus b into brackets, open bracket a minus b. Then here, a standing as x minus 1 or raised to power 3, and b standing as. 5 raised to the power 3. Then what we have here becomes x minus 1 or raised to the power 3 plus 5 raised to the power 3 into brackets. Then open brackets x minus 1 or raised to the power 3 minus 5 raised to the power 3 close brackets. Then equals to 0 here. That is here, we have two possible cases. The first one, x minus 1, or raised to the power 3, plus 5 raised to the power 3, equals to 0. Or we have x minus 1, or raised to the power 3, minus 5 raised to the power 3, equals to 0 here. That is solving on this side. This follows when we have a raised to the power 3, plus b raised to the power 3. Which is the same thing as a plus b into brackets, then open bracket a square minus a b plus b square. That is here, what we have becomes x minus 1 plus 5 into brackets, open bracket x minus 1 or square minus 5 times x minus 1. Then plus 5 square close bracket equals to 0 here. At this here, we have x plus 4 into brackets. Then open bracket expansion here give us x square minus 2x plus 1. Minus 5 open this bracket, we have plus 5x plus 5. Minus 5x rather, minus 5x plus 5. Then plus 5 square, that's 25. Close bracket equals to zero here. That is here we have x plus four into brackets. The open bracket and rise as x square minus two x minus five x as minus seven x. Five plus twenty five that's thirty. Then plus one that's plus thirty one. Close bracket equals to zero here. Then here we have two possible cases. The first one x plus 4 equals to 0, or we have x squared minus 7x plus 31 equals to 0 here. Then solving on this side, we have x equals to minus 4, which is a real solution here. And here we have a quadratic equation where a equals to 1, b equals to minus 7. And c equals to 31. Then apply the quadratic equation here. That is x equals to minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a. That is here we have x equals to minus minus 7 plus or minus square root of minus 7 square minus 4 times 1 times 31 all over 2 times 1. At least here we have x equals to minus times minus as plus. This becomes 7 plus or minus square root of minus 7 square as 49. Then minus 4 times 1 times 31. We have 124 over 2. At this year we have x equals to 7 plus or minus square root of 49 minus 124, that gives us minus 75 over 2. And next step here, we can rewrite this and we have x equals to 7 plus or minus square root of 25 times 3 
times minus 1 over 2. Okay. When we separate this with 25, that's 5, we take it out and we have x equals to 7 plus or minus 5. Then we have root 3, root minus 1 is i over 2. That is, here we have two complex solutions here. Then, solving from the second case here, this follows what we have a raised to power 3 minus b raised to power 3. Put the same thing as a minus b into bracket, open bracket a square plus a b plus b square. That is, here, what we have becomes x minus 1 minus 5 into brackets then open bracket x minus 1 all square plus 5 times x minus 1 plus 5 square plus bracket equals to 0 here then yeah this same thing as x minus 6 into brackets open bracket expansion here give us x square minus 2x plus 1 5 open this bracket we have plus 5x minus 5 then plus 5 squared that's 25 close bracket equals to 0 here that this here is same thing as x minus 6 into bracket open bracket x squared minus 2x plus 5x that's plus 3x then we have 25 minus 5 that's 20 and plus 1 that's plus 21 Close bracket equals to zero here. That is here. We also have two possible cases. The first one, x minus six equals to zero, or we have x square plus three x plus twenty one equals to zero here. That is here. We have x equals to six, which is a real solution here. Yeah, also we have a quadratic equation where he equals to 1, b equals to 3, and c equals to 21. And applying the quadratic formula, what we have becomes x equals to minus 3 plus or minus square root of 3 square minus 4 times 1 times 21 over 2 times 1. Then here we have x equals to minus 3 plus or minus square root of 3 squared, that's 9, then minus 4 times 1 times 21, that gives us 84 over 2. That is x equals to minus 3 plus or minus square root of. And then minus 84, that's minus 25 over 2. That is, we can write this as x equals to minus 3 plus or minus square root of 25 times 3 times minus 1 over 2. That is, I will separate this with 25, that's why we take it out. And we have x equals to minus 3 plus or minus. 5 and we have root 3 root minus 1 is i over 2. Also, here we have two complex solutions here, and all together in this problem we have six solutions here, two solutions here, two complex solutions here, and also two complex solutions here. And thank you for watching. Don't forget the steps. Subscribe for more videos and turn the notification bell. Share this video, give it a thumbs up, and put your comment. See you next class and bye for now.